Columbia, South Carolina, where great things are happening and great things are being made. <coughs> to you that are out in the land this morning, wherever you are, we greet you in the name of a risen Savior. For this morning, for a few moments, we want to talk from the book of Exodus 3, 1 through 5. 3, 1 through 5. Say amen. Amen. Now Moses kept the flock of Jethro, his father-in-law, the priest of Midian, and he led the flock to to the backside of the desert and came to the mountain and came to the mountain of God even to Horeb and the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a flame of fire out of the midst of a bush and he looked and behold the bush burned with fire and the bush was not consumed and Moses said, I will not turn aside and seek this great sight while the bush is not burned. And when the Lord saw that he had turned aside to seek, God called unto him out of the midst of the bush and said, Moses, Moses. And Moses said, Here am I. And he said, Draw not hither. Put off thy shoes from off thy feet, for the place where thy standest is holy ground. We want to talk from the subject this morning, where were you when God called you? Amen. Where were you when God called you? The question is that we ought to know where we were when God called us. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Now, Moses is the author of the book of Exodus. was written by Moses. The word Moses means water. Right. Can I get a witness here? See, sometimes folks ought to know what the meaning of a man's name ought to be. Can I get a witness here? Some folk name their children, they don't know the meaning of what their children name is. They name them anything. Can I get a witness here? But you know the older folks, our sister bird, used to name their children after somebody in the Bible. Can I get a witness here? Abraham and uh, Isaac and Jacob and, and all of those young men. That's what men got their name from one time because their name had a meaning to it. Can I get a witness here? Now, whether they held the name up or not, their name meant something from the Bible. Can I get a witness here? They didn't even name their, 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 their daughters, Sister Brown, Esther, and Ruth, and all of them people. Can I get a witness here? But the day we go to the dictionary and get some names that nobody can pronounce, and they can't hardly spell them themselves. Can I get a witness here? So you just want a name. If I want a name for my son, I know a lady that when Barack Obama was the president, she wanted to name her baby Barack. 
Can I get a witness here? So, but she didn't know her mother asked her, said, now do you know the meaning, what this name means? Can I get a witness? Now, now, if you don't know what the name means, why name your baby after somebody you never met or never seen? Can I get a witness here? Never had come in contact with. But, 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 but when God said in the Bible, name that child, same thing, God had a reason. Can I get a witness here? Uh, 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 for naming that child what he told them to name him. Can I get a witness here? Amen. See, God has a purpose for everything. Can I get a witness here? Amen. You want to name your child after somebody who will never, may never be president of the United States of America. Somebody help me here. Amen. Can I get a witness here? So, a name sometimes means something, Sister Brown. Can I get a witness here? Amen. See, God has a purpose with names. Can I get a witness here? In, in, in the Old Testament, now we know the story of Moses, don't we? Yeah. You know Moses' mother was pregnant with him. Can I get a witness here? And, and, and you know what Pharaoh said. Pharaoh said you got to kill every boy child. Can I get some help here? And, and, and so then she heard and, and heard what the news had said, but got around. And after she had birthed the baby, she kept the baby down by the riverside. Can I get over there? And let's go hide the baby. See, you don't understand one thing that you don't sometimes just hold your peace. That's Can right. I get a witness here? Right. Because you never know when the move of God is on. Can I get a witness here? So then, but she went and hid the baby, and, and, and but something happened. See, let me tell you something. You don't have to worry or get disturbed about anything in this world. Can I get a witness here? You don't have to get disturbed when things are not going your way. Amen. Can I get a witness? You don't have to get disturbed when you hear some bad news. Can I get a help here? Can I get a witness here? Because God will make a way out of no way. Can I get some help here? Amen. God will make a way out of no way. See, she carried Mo Moses and hid him in the water. Can I get a witness here? Amen. Laid him up there. She didn't have no determination what was going to happen to this child. I wish I had some help here. Amen. In other words, she didn't have no inkling that somebody was going to come along and find this baby. Can I get a witness here? That, 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 there's some time ago that, 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 that you've heard the story of the woman who left the baby in the trash can. Had no inkling how it was going to pick the baby up. Can I get a witness yet? But see, no matter what you do, God always has a way out of no way. Oh, can I get a witness yet? So it was God who laid his hand, who had put his spirit there for her, somebody else to walk by and find this baby. Yeah, yeah. Can I get a witness here? Amen. See, we've all been lost sometime once or another, isn't that right? Yeah. So, but God put it into somebody's spirit to walk by and find you. Talk to me, somebody. Yeah. We've all been in the dark. Haven't we been there? Huh? We've all been lost sometime or another. Ain't it said up in the church today? Look like you ain't never been lost. Can I get a witness here? Because sometimes somebody had to come to us. But God made the way. He put it in their spirit. Talk to me, somebody. To come by and talk to you. Can I get a witness here? So, but, 
But see, when God is in the forefront, can't nothing happen without God making a way. Right. Can I get a witness yet? So, 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 Moses was there a baby. He couldn't help himself. Can I get a witness yet? Yeah. But, but God put it in. God had already made a way. Can I get a witness here? Mm -hmm. Sister Brown, you don't have to worry about anything. You don't have to look sad. You don't have to do anything because whatever happens, God has already made a way. Can I get a witness? God is not going to put you in something. He can't take you through something. Oh, I wish I had some help here. Can I get a witness here? So, so Moses, 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 Moses was read up. The, the, the lady found Moses and carried Moses back and, and adopted Moses. Pharaoh, Eve, adopted. See, God got a way. Can I get a witness here? God always have a way out, Brother Mom. Even though when we can't see the way, God has a way. Can I get a witness here? God always have a plan. He have a plan A, and he have a plan B. He have a plan C, and he have a plan D. Can I get a witness here? That's why I tell Bishop Red Farm a lot of times, don't worry about the crowd. Can I get a witness? Because God got a plan B. Can I get a witness here? If he allow you to get the plan A, don't you know he preferates you for plan B? Can I get a witness here? Amen. So, so Moses, 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 Moses had to go through something. Can I get a witness here? He just didn't go straight to Egypt. Talk to me, y'all. He was in Pharaoh's coat. And, and you know the story of Moses. Moses killed a man. Oh, I wish I had some help yet. See, see, folks look at you funny when you done done some wrong. <laughs> huh? When you done done, see, let me tell you something. God can use everybody. It doesn't matter whether he a liar. God can change a liar. It doesn't matter whether he a, 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 a rogue or not. God can change a rogue. Can I get a witness here? It's all in the plans of God. Oh, I wish I had some help here. See, we have all sinned and come shout of the glory of God. All of us come from somewhere to where we're at now. Can I get a witness? We have not all been here like this always. Can I get a witness here? We all came through the midnight hour. Oh, I wish I had some help here. So then, but where were you when God called you? What are you doing when God called you? Can I get a witness here? What was going on in your perspective life when God called you? Can I get a witness? See, God don't wait before come to church and, 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 and look like church folk to call you. Can I get a witness? If you don't believe that, look at Brother Jeremiah. God said to Jeremiah, I knew who you were before you entered your mother's womb. Can I get a witness? God knew, Brother Miles, that you was going to be preaching today. Where before you even were born. Can I get a witness here? No matter what you done in your life, you didn't do nothing too bad that God could not use you now. Or talk to me, somebody. Yeah. I wish I had some help here. See, people look cock uh, in the church when they know somebody done done something. They know something about your business, your past, Sister Brown. Yeah. They look cock at that you when you walk in the church. Uh, can I get a witness? Like they, like they ain't never done nothing. Can I get a witness? But we have all, Paul said, we have all sinned and come shout on the glory of God. Can I get a witness here? 
But Moses killed a man. And I'm just giving you a few scenarios of who Moses was. Can I get a witness? I told you his name meant water. Can I get a witness here? And nobody can do nothing without water. You can do without food, brother. But you need water. Can I get a witness yet? Because he was found in the water. Can I get a witness yet? So, 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 so. After being found, Moses killed a man. And, and he went and thought. Can I get a witness yet? That nobody would know anything about you. Can I get a witness? See, you can run, but you can't hide. Not from God. <laughs> you may hide from man. You may change your name. <laughs> you may change your look. But you can't change your heart. Can I get a witness here? See, God knows you by your heart, not your name. A name don't mean nothing to God, but what's in your heart really means something to God. Can I get a witness here? So then Moses went out by himself. He thought he was out there by himself. See, never think that you by yourself. I don't care how lonely you get. I don't care how bad the situation may seem. But you got to understand, Bishop, you're never by yourself. Can I get a witness here? Because God knows where you are. He knows who you are. Can I get a witness? So, so, so you can't hide from God. Can I get a witness here? So Moses decided, I'm, I'm going out here. But soon as Moses got out here, he looked up and saw Jethro. Talk to me, somebody. He thought, I'm going out here in the mountain. And I'm going to have me a good time. I ain't worried about going back there to Egypt. Can I get a witness here? But let me tell you something. Wherever God called you from, he'll send you right back there. Yeah. Or talk to me, somebody. Yeah. See, Moses thought, nah, I'm out here. I got it made. I, I, I don't need nobody. But out here, I'm alone. Yeah. Can I get a witness here? As I told you, that you'll never alone. It may seem that way. It may seem like you're in a deserted place. But let me tell you something. Wherever you at, the Spirit of God is right there. You can't go nowhere where God cannot find you. Can I get a witness? So, so, so that's what happened. And Moses went up there and there and he saw that Jethro, and he saw some women, and, and, and you know how it is, Brother Ma, when you see a good-looking woman. You read to check it out, ain't you? <laughs> Moses, let me check this thing out. You got to get a witness yet. So did, but Moses didn't know, understanding that God was preparating him. See, you got to go through preparation before you get anywhere. Can I get a witness? I don't care where you go or what you do, there is preparation, period. So Moses had to go as a hurry to a close, that Moses had to go through some preparation, period. Can I get a witness yet? First of all, he became a sheep herder. I wish I had some, some help here. See, if you don't know how to lead sheep, you can't lead people. Talk to me, somebody. So God was preparing Moses, and, and, and as Moses was going, as I heard to close, as Moses was going from one side to the other, he looked, Sister Brown, and saw this bush on fire. Can I get away? See, God knows how to get your attention. So Moses didn't pay it any attention on its way. He said, well, soon that when he comes back through that bush ought to be burned up. Can I get a witness here? See, it seemed like, Sister Bird, sometimes some people look like they ain't going to make it, Brother Ma. 
Can I get a witness here? But let me tell you something. God has a way of taking that same person you think ain't going to be nothing and make something out of that person. Can I get a witness here? So Moses soon that. See, a summation don't get you nowhere. You got to have true fact. Can I get a witness here? People assume that you may not be saved. Oh, talk to me somebody. People assume that you may not can't play the piano. People assume that you may not can't preach, Brother Ma. People just assume things. Can I get a witness here? But see, God knows things. That's what makes the difference. I don't care what people assume about me. I don't care what people say about me. Can I get a witness? It all left in the hands of God. Can I get a witness here? At the final analysis, man don't have no heaven or hell to put you in. Or talk to me, y'all. So Moses, on his way back, looked and saw that bush was still burning. It got his attention. See, God has a way of getting your attention. Yeah. That'll get a witness here. Yeah. Moses. Looked at the bush and said, seeing though it ought to have been burned up, let me step over here. Can I get a witness here? And, and let me step over here. As soon as Moses stepped towards the bush, God called Moses and said to Moses, Moses, can I get a witness? He didn't say break, he said Moses. He didn't say Miles. He said Moses. Right. See, if he had just called everybody, everybody might have came. Yeah. But they wouldn't have understood the situation. Well. Can I get a witness here? But where were you when God called you? What you were doing when God called you? Amen. That's what we ought to do. Ought to be word. That's what we ought to be thinking about right now. What was I when God called? What I was doing? Can I get a witness? Yeah. See, some folks say, "Well, the Lord called me, but you wasn't doing nothing." That's why it seemed hard, Brother Miles, for some folk to make it, because they said God called them, but they wasn't doing nothing when God called. See, God don't call nobody if you ain't doing right. nothing. Right. Can I get a witness? You just going around here claiming something. Can I get a witness? Amen. But if you were doing something, even though it was wrong, talk to me. When the Lord called, and he called a lot of them when they were wrong. Oh, yeah. Talk to me, somebody. He didn't call folk when they got right. He called everybody when they were wrong. Can I get a witness here? Oh, y'all don't hear me this morning. If you ain't doing nothing, God can't use you. You don't go to school for God to call you. And whoever said they do, you tell them that's wrong, said they're telling the biggest lie I've ever been told. Can I get a witness? Moses was doing something that God could use him. Or talk to me, somebody. Yes. See, everybody got a gift, brother mine, that God can use. Now, whether you do it after you've been called, well. or whether you're doing it Amen. to be called, it's determined how God sees you. Amen. I wish I had some help here. See, some folks, I was driving down the road, and I saw a big cat. Some people said they saw this and they saw that. But let me tell y'all something. You don't have to see nothing. All right. Talk to me, somebody. All right. Some people said, well, and I, 
I had this dream. Mm -hmm. I, I, I fell out the long fish pen. <laughs> and before I hit the float, <laughs> something happened. <laughs> yeah, it did. <laughs> something should have happened. Can I get over this here? So, but Moses was busy hiding the sheep of his father-in-law. Can I get over this here? And if you can lead sheep, you can lead people. Because people are just like sheep, bro, man. They are not, they are biblical, they eat, go anywhere except where you lead them. Oh, yeah, man, I ain't going to have no help here this morning. Amen, lights. Amen. Huh? And not only that, but see, a shepherd leads the sheep. He is always in front of the sheep. He never behind. He never on the side. And I feel sorry for some of these churches because while shepherds send other folk to lead their sheep. Mm. Oh, I wish I had some help here. I ain't gonna have no help. Can I get a witness here? Yes, if God called you to be the church leader, well. you lead. Yes, Can I get a witness here? But Moses looked at the bush yeah. and assumed that it ought to be burned up. But when he looked and took a step, Bishop, yeah. that's when God spoke to him. If you don't take a step, then my God ain't going to say nothing. You got to take a step. He said, if you make one step, I'll make two. Didn't he say it? Yeah. Moses took a step yeah. to see, and God called him and said, Moses, Moses, got Moses' attention. See, God can't do nothing until he gets your attention. Right. Right. Sometimes, look at the hurricane, y'all. Mm -hmm. I wish I had some help here. Look at Florida. God trying to get somebody's attention. Huh? See, 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 see. God don't have to speak loud. He just speak. <laughs> Can I get a witness here? She, she. So, so Moses looked and as I come to a close this morning, Moses. Moses said, what do you want? I, I, I just can imagine Bishop Moses. Wait a minute. What, what, what do you want? <laughs> How do you know I was out here? <laughs> Can I get a witness here? If that's in the day society. Yeah. But see, when God spoke to Moses, he got Moses' attention. And said, Moses, the first thing I want you to do is pull your shoes off. Yeah. For the ground you standing on is holy ground. Wherever the presence of God is, Bishop, is holy ground. I wish I had some help here. See, sometimes folk misunderstand that they can do anything in the house of God and get by. Well, you can't do nothing in the house of God that God don't see. Can I get a winner? Because this place is holy. God has anointed it. And not only that, he got more attention than that Moses. This is what I want you to do. Go down to Egypt and tell Pharaoh to let my people go. Can I get a witness here? Amen. Moses looked at him and said, wait a minute. You know I can't speak plain. Excuses. See why the people in the church are suffering because they use too many excuses. Can I get a witness? I didn't feel good this morning. I had my children to come over. Can I get a witness? If you had your children to come over and you shown up was a saint of God, you'd have told your children, let's go to church. 
Can I get a win? Because that's where I'm going. I'm not going to let nothing stop me from doing the Lord's will. Yeah. Can I get a win? Yeah. Because at the close, I heard Paul say, I will let nothing separate me from the love of God. Right. Can I get a witness here? Yeah. Because while I'm determined, Sister Brown, that Jesus, who made this baby, can I get a witness here? Yeah. Jesus, Jesus. made this little baby, the bright and morning star, yeah. the lily of the valley. Yeah. Can I get a witness here? Not only that, but he was grandmama's leaning post. He was granddaddy's walking king. Can I get a witness here? See, every now and then, I can feel him moving on the inside. I'm determined this morning, I'm not going to let nothing separate me from the love of God. I may be blind and cannot see. I may be lame and cannot walk. Can I get a witness? I may be hopeless and can't find help. But I know who is my helper. And my helper is Jesus Christ. Who one Friday, the, one Friday, the, they carried him up go goggles hill. Now, they nailed him the, in the hand. Now, they put rivers in his feet. Da, but early, da, early, da, somebody say early, da, early, da, Sunday morning, da, he got up da, out of the grave da, and said, all power da, is in my hand. Da, ain't he all right? Da, do you know him today? Da, do you know him? Da, where were you? Da, when the Lord called you, da, can I get a witness here? That's all you got to do is know where you were when the Lord called you. Yeah. It <laughs>